South Korean peacekeepers in South Sudan are helping youths gain some useful skills with which they can make a living. In the town of Bo, United Nations peacekeepers are providing a vocational training program in baking. These hands could pass for those of a skilled baker, but barely a year ago, 25-year-old Monica Awalith knew little or nothing about baking. Now her baking skills are sharper, thanks to a 12-week hands-on baking course run by South Korean troops deployed to Town in South Sudan. At first, I thought I was just to come here to pass my time, but I realized this my dream might be. So doing a lot of baking with the new instructors coming, I gain more experience and a lot of information on how to bake. She has been training on baking Swiss rolls, baguettes, brownies, bread and donuts, among other confectionaries. And now there's a reason to smile. When I cooked and most of my customers, they said, what you are cooking is so tasteful. It's made me more excited and I will even be proud to tell them that I'm the one doing it. So that makes me happy and I'm enjoying doing what I'm doing. Monica is among five other students perfecting their skills on an extended bakery training program at this vocational training center. The tutor at the bakery class is 22-year-old Gu Janun, who is also a student in global Korean cuisine back home. Little did he know that he would be sent to serve as a peacekeeper in conflict-afflicted South Sudan when he was enlisted in the military. I was very worried at the beginning because these students were new to bakery and baking, but I have noticed that all these students are very committed to baking here at the class, and also they are fast learners, and they follow along very well. Korean peacekeepers have been serving in South Sudan as engineers since 2013 and have been running this vocational training center aimed at developing self-sustaining basic skills amongst the youth since April 2016. For beneficiaries like Monica, both the bakery and life skills she has learned has changed her life in many ways. We are so happy that most of the men are coming to our class now and in our traditions it is against our culture for a man to cook, but now they're changing. Like now we have one guy who does two, two actually. So, and also it's bring unity, because we have different people from a different state, and especially some are from POC and the one from Botown. So it's kind of unity. We try to learn from each other. For many South Sudanese youth like Monica, the protracted conflict in South Sudan dealt a heavy dent on their morale, their hopes and dreams. But with this newfound appreciation for baking skills obtained at this training center, Monica believes that nothing will stop her from achieving her dream of becoming an entrepreneur.